Ruthie Simone. Welcome back to my channel. I am back today with another pick a car reading, okay? And today we are going to be doing classy, bougie, ratchet, what makes you a savage, okay? So we got four piles here. We got pile number one, pile number two, pile number three, and pile number four. So you want to meditate for a few seconds, close your eyes, and use your intuition to pick the pile or the piles if it is more than one that calls out to you. And I will see you guys at your reading. So what makes you a savage, okay? Okay, let's find out. Hey, pal number one. So if you chose the carnelian, welcome to your reading. So right off the bag, okay, so I feel like what makes you a savage, y'all probably real creative, okay? Y'all probably like real fiery. A lot of y'all could be fire signs or like have a lot of fire in y'all chart. Aries Leo Sagittarius. But I just also feel like y'all are really sexy, okay? Y'all probably like to wear like red lipstick or like y'all um, could just like to be in red or just y'all like to just get spicy. I'm feeling like somebody that like to dress up and like maybe even go out. So like maybe y'all I'll be busting fits and stuff like when y'all go out to the club well when we could go out when it wasn't you know corona <laughs> but it's like um it's like like just like the way you carry yourself like your creativity like your sex appeal i like i'm really feeling like a lot of y'all like when y'all wear red lipstick honey like y'all be popping okay and if ain't nobody ever tell you which i'm sure they did i'm here to tell you like red like you know that's y'all color y'all could like really love red some of y'all favorite color could be real or y'all could um really like to wear red a lot so we gonna get into it first we have a person and then we have a song so what makes you a savage so we get cash it by megan the stallion so not only are y'all you know this sexy and creative energy y'all about y'all coin y'all about y'all bag and y'all not about letting a man come in and mess it up okay like y'all on y'all cash shit, and that's just that on that period okay so we got cash shit by megan the stallion and then we got rihanna so wow okay so like y'all like y'all could like fenty or like have a lot of fenty you know makeup products but you know rihanna is like she really like don't need a man she's like very independent but she's also very sexy and you know rihanna is very risque so like yeah definitely i'm seeing real or like y'all could like to um wear like clothes that are a little bit more revealing which ain't nothing wrong with it because i do too but like people just think like the way you carry yourself is sexy like you got like the most savage out of the savages <laughs> so it's just like literally like you own your stuff you not like letting nobody come in the way between your cash shit and what you got going on i feel like y'all don't mind dating but it's like y'all not gonna let nobody like fuck your head up or nothing like that so that's what i'm getting right off the bag but we gonna get into it and we gonna see what makes y'all a savage okay come on now. we got the sun so yeah y'all shine so bright it's like when y'all like walk into the room people be like dang who is that y'all walking in the room with y'all got y'all red lip on got y'all y'all could like to wear thigh high boots or just like like i said just get real dressed up so it's like you like shine so brightly shit even when you're not dressing up it's just like people like like just really acknowledge your light and with this sun here too i'm just getting picking up on leo energy so like i said fire sign some of y'all could be aries leo sagittarius but this goes back again to the creativity you guys could even like to like really 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 get into fashion and y'all outfits and people admire and appreciate that about y'all like the way y'all dress like the way y'all put stuff together i'm hearing um fancy by drake so it's just like you know nail done nails done hair done everything did it's just like people love the way you're, you carry yourself like even if you like don't notice on some days people always like notice your light and they notice that you take the time out to like create the things that you want and create these outfits to bust your fit okay so next we got prince or well, princess you guys take it how it you know resonates but it's like y'all are some charmers we got romantic charm and potential for power so like y'all could be real flirtatious i'm hearing like y'all could be like even having people like we get the knees like when y'all talk to them y'all probably be giving people that little you know that little eye that little glare <laughs> y'all probably be um you know making a lot of eye contact with people and that just makes them hot i feel like like people just look into your eyes and just like see the sun see the light y'all probably got a lot of people out here thinking that they y'all soulmates okay <laughs> but i'm just feeling like y'all could like even potentially just like be flirting with people without even realizing it just because like you so damn fine like people just like dang i like her and like you coming off being way like really nice could come off to other people as oh dang she want me she flirting with me because they want you so it's like <laughs> it's like y'all are real charmers and like the power of flirting it could be a lot of gemini's in this pile too and a lot of libras i'm hearing but it's like the power of y'all flirting or just like even just like being nice to like somebody um 
that's romantically interested in you like that just makes them hot like that just makes them like see you in, in an even brighter light i'm seeing with the sun here we got vampires so make sure aware that someone or something is draining your life force so back again with cash and rihanna like y'all not afraid to like cut somebody off or cut a love situation off like when it's no longer serving you like oh this this what you doing this how you acting yeah y'all could be like dang this what you want this what you doing like y'all know rihanna she like does not play like she does not tolerate no shit she will like quickly leave you like in a hurry and like just get back to her bag and create her empire so it's like if it's any energy vampires around you or just like people that you just feel like you know trying to use you or just trying to take advantage of you or like you know just try to take advantage of your life like y'all are quick to end it because shit you the prince you the princess you could easily go out and find somebody else like y'all not worried about energies that don't serve you and energies that want to take advantage of you we got solar plexus yup because y'all are confident look at this solar plexus in the sun it could definitely be some leos in here but y'all are confident y'all are creative y'all probably um a couple of you guys could have had low self-esteem at one point but you just done so much work on yourself like can't nobody get to you because you accept yourself fully the number three could be important okay or some of you guys could even be born in march okay and rihanna is definitely a pisces and pisces season covers march i think yeah so yeah y'all just have like this confidence that like I'm hearing people like know that they can't fuck with you people know that they can't fuck you over because you gonna quick to be like listen I didn't sign up for this and I don't have to take this okay so we get a th yep <laughs> we got authority y'all big Aries energy okay big fire sign energy so like I said, y'all are in control. It's like y'all creating y'all own reality. And y'all not letting, like, nobody get in the way of it. Like, y'all don't care who y'all got to cut off, who y'all, um got to separate yourselves from y'all could have at one point had a lot of friends that were trying to use you or just was like being shady because they was jealous of your life so i'm feeling like this pal could definitely you could attract a lot of jealousy too i'm feeling like this pal like you over friendships like you over clicks like you like don't even fuck with that no more because it's like people be jealous of your life people be jealous of the energy that you bring okay i'm hearing bloom and a couple of you guys could like sunflowers as well but like i just feel like what makes y'all a savage is y'all are in control of y'all reality y'all not letting no man get in y'all hair or woman and y'all not letting no people that's fake come in y'all aura and use y'all energy okay we, we get um message in a bottle so yeah um <laughs> I really feel like it could be a y'all have a lot of secret admirers that's what it is y'all could have a lot of people stalking y'all social media looking at y'all pictures okay but it's somebody in particular this could be a, um a leo or aries i'm hearing somebody in particular wants to send you a message because they admire your creativity your drive and your passion okay and um I feel like this person could contact you soon. This is a sad note. But it's like, y'all gonna have to make the decision. Are they a prince or are they a vampire? Okay, so like, I feel like y'all got really good discernment. Ugh, sorry. Discernment in the romance department as well. But definitely, um, this um figure wants to send you a message they want to say hey what's up hello will you be my trap queen <laughs> nah i'm just playing i'm just playing but it's like somebody definitely trying to um you know slide up in your dms and see what's popping we got truth be told oh child y'all okay so this is sad note um for somebody a couple of y'all watching this this like if this resonates for you like this is confirmation for what you already been feeling i'm hearing so it's somebody that wants to talk to you and they want to tell you the truth about how they feel okay this this person dang near might even be in love with you okay <laughs> this person wants to come to you send you a message and tell you the truth okay i feel like you could have at one point seen them as an energy vampire but they want to you know set the record straight like i'm here to you know be your prince i'm here to be your knight in shining armor i'm just coming here to tell you the truth about how i feel okay and <laughs> uh, some of y'all like some of y'all could be happy to hear from this person but some of y'all could have even been waiting to hear from this person for so long y'all just like what the fuck like what do you want now like i'm hearing some of y'all say but it's like if you've been uh if this resonating for you like this is a sign that somebody is going to send you a message and they're going to tell you the truth about how they feel about you and with the sun being here i'm feeling like they um like they not gonna be holding back at all like everything is gonna come to light like they gonna shine a light on how they feel about everything okay and that's um i feel like that's the only way that they feel like they could get in with you is if they be completely honest we have yin yang hold on y'all 
know y'all just ain't come up in here and make this a love reading. Now y'all, <laughs> y'all better get on. We got yin and yang. Somebody wants to come and tell you that they are your soulmate, okay? Somebody is just admiring how savage you are and just feels like you, they person, feels like you're the one. But something that also makes you savage, I am feeling like, is with this a vampire right above this yin yang, it's like y'all accept y'all darkness. Y'all accept y'all shadow side, okay? It's like, y'all know um, Rihanna how she had good girl gone bad she had disturbia she had all them songs that was kind of like you know like letting her unleash her like inner bad girl and i'm hearing bad girl by usher too y'all some of y'all could like that song but it's like y'all like don't mind embodying the darkness because you know that you need the light and the dark okay so it's like you know people just like love the fact that you are okay being whole okay that you um are savage because you accept the parts of yourself that many people are afraid to accept in themselves we got angela love here too so so okay i feel like Okay, y'all could even have a hard exterior or like some of y'all could even like to wear black, I'm hearing. But it's like y'all could have this like hard exterior or people see you as like, um, like I'm feeling like untouchable, unreachable. Like people feel like they can't get to you. But really on the inside, it's like you a loving person. But like you, your savage just literally, it just like shines all over you. People don't know how to approach you. That's why I said people really think that they can't fuck with you. But it's like inside, you could be all mush. And you know, that's what makes you even more savage. Like I said, the balance, like the polarity, like you embody your whole self. I feel like y'all are also not afraid of um, the parts of y'all selves that, you know, you may not even be the proudest of. I'm feeling like we have trust so um with this being right under authority i feel like y'all trust y'all selves making decisions which makes y'all a savage okay y'all not the type to just sit around and wait for things to come to you or wait for people to bring change into your lives y'all get up and you do it for yourself i'm getting like the sense like you create your own empire like you have so much trust and faith in yourself and your plans and your goals that you know you don't mind taking risks you don't mind going after the things that you know you want to go after for you so you know I just feel like you guys are just really badass. Like the energy coming off this pal is crazy. I keep going back to this vampire card and I'm just getting a feeling like y'all like just like real sexy like real badass like you know and y'all could even too I'm hearing like y'all don't um y'all don't give it all away at once like y'all the type to like leave people wanting for more you see how she look like you know okay i'm about to go sneak off i'm about to go um, i'm about to go do whatever i'm about to go be private for a couple months and then y'all pop back up like bam here i am you miss me <laughs> i heard you bitches was looking for me here i go <laughs> but yeah it's like y'all not afraid to take a step back and to you know have your me time to collect yourselves and get yourselves together it's like y'all energy is expensive and it's like y'all um, know when it's time to pull back and when it's time to retreat and when it's time to pop back up and shine your light. I'm here. We got stillness. Yeah, y'all know when to be still. Y'all know when it's like, okay, maybe I should pull back. Maybe I should draw back. And, like, I feel like that's why so many people want y'all and desire y'all because y'all are not a needy energy. I'm getting, like, a very strong, independent energy. Like, y'all aren't, like, needing for anybody. I feel like y'all have really, like, really, really, really dug deep with deep within yourselves and confronted some insecurities that you may have had or like forgiving yourselves for like mistakes so it's like y'all don't like need no validation from nobody because you found the power within yourself to give it to yourself it's like you don't need somebody that you know may not have even gone through all that you went through to validate you because you know deep down inside that you are enough i'm feeling and if you don't know you better know okay period so we got transformation so yeah like i said y'all could have been through a lot y'all been through a lot of transformation y'all have worked on y'all on on yourselves i'm hearing this could even have started three to four years ago um or like y'all are on y'all could have like had a spiritual awakening three or four years ago or just tried to start doing better within life okay um 
And I'm feeling like, yeah, it's like y'all just can't be fucked with because y'all been through it all. It's like, can't anybody shame you for anything that you've been through or anything that you've done? And it's like, what makes you a savage is that you have taken every bad experience that you've had in life and you have like just transformed that shit into something so much greater, so much bigger. Like, y'all are my alchemists. What makes you a savage is that you are an alchemist and you're not afraid to, you know, go after things. And I'm feeling like, especially Especially like with women um, and if you chose this pal it's like you know they say the most masculine men are feminine and the most feminine women are masculine and like you need masculine energy like even with Rihanna like Rihanna definitely carries like an air of masculine energy like she's in control like she got this she is savage so it's like y'all have that underlying independent masculine energy that you know people that's why people feel like they can't fuck with you like I said y'all not needy y'all are just free and y'all are ready to explore the world and it's like if nobody gonna come along and do it with you you don't mind doing it by yourself we got magician here okay so it's in reverse so i'm feeling like y'all don't like let people like control you y'all don't let people manipulate you y'all don't let people walk all over you it's like y'all are like okay if you think you're gonna control me you better find another one because you got the wrong one okay it's like y'all are very hard to manipulate y'all could even be impasse as well we got six of pentacles yeah it's a lot of people watching y'all stalking y'all social media and i feel like this is the same person if that message resonated for you before like you've been waiting on somebody to contact you they are watching your social media like heavy heavy like they they ain't missed the story yet okay Ciao. <laughs> we got king of pentacles so yeah y'all are in y'all bag y'all are in y'all coin but you see how she kind of had it behind you know this thing so that goes back to like y'all know when to pull back y'all can even shoot y'all be faking playing shy sometimes <laughs> y'all people y'all probably be getting people to come chase after y'all because y'all be faking shy but really like you in the background like oh yeah i got you now <laughs> we got five of swords so yeah um with it like i said y'all could like to wear black y'all like look real bomb and like black or red but it's like y'all back could be real sexy too but like y'all got like some nice bodies okay y'all got a nice back a nice booty it's like okay and then like a couple of you guys could like to wear your hair pushed back um what's that um <laughs> for mean girls you look sexy with your hair pushed back <laughs> So a couple of y'all like definitely look nice with like nice buns or nice updo. Speaking of updos, a lot of y'all got that wop. <laughs> And it's like, I just feel like y'all aren't afraid to like unleash your inner sexy, okay, with this five of swords here. Yep, y'all like got beauty. Um, I'm hearing beauty by um Drew Hill. So like y'all definitely know y'all fine. Here go that red again. We got y'all, I'm sorry for the shadows in this. We got trophy. Oh, y'all. Like, people think you are the prize. Like, let me tell you. If you didn't think you was the prize, people looking at you like the whole damn sun, okay? Like, people feel like, if I get with that, like, I'm the man or I'm the woman. <laughs> but, like, it's like, y'all just winning, I'm feeling like. And y'all, like, win because, like I said, y'all aren't afraid to embrace all aspects of y'all selves. We have daydreaming. So, like I said, it's somebody watching y'all. It's somebody daydreaming about y'all they trying to make a plan on how they gonna come into y'all lives and get back good with y'all or this could be even you like y'all could have daydreamed so much about y'all future in the past like now it's all starting to come around it's all starting to manifest and then we got creative here so yeah like i said y'all are definitely creative when it comes down to the outfits when it comes down to your art whatever it is whatever you create like i said just y'all just got this energy like this powerful i'm getting marilyn monroe even like this kind of like i don't want to say sex bomb <laughs> but like you could be like if you wanted to but it's like y'all just got like this vibrant just sexual creative energy and you guys know creative energy is sexual energy so yeah that's why i'm getting y'all that's what makes y'all a savage so i hope y'all enjoyed this reading if you did don't forget to like share comment and subscribe and i will see y'all in the next video
hey pal number two if you chose this blue crystal welcome to your reading so like i associate this crystal with focus okay so y'all are for no distractions okay and i'm hearing um no bullshit by chris brown <laughs> so a couple of y'all that have picked this pal i'm feeling like y'all the type okay like say y'all hooked up with somebody um whether it be you went over there they came to your house it's like y'all not afraid to kick somebody out after they start boring you you like okay um this is over now. I have things to do. So you got to leave or I'm about to dip. I'm getting that type of energy for some of y'all. Like, <laughs> damn, like y'all not afraid to like cut it out. Like when it becomes a distraction or when you get bored. So a couple of you guys could be Gemini's. I'm also um, hearing Pisces. But it's like, like y'all don't like to be bored. And as soon as y'all get bored, like y'all focus shift to like something else. And like people could feel like you like kind of like unattainable. Or, like people like really stress about like... <laughs> making sure that you like are happy or like making sure that you know they're like doing enough to entertain you or keep you around like people feel like you a savage because like you just like so like free it's like y'all you're not afraid to like leave some behind or change directions when you feel like something is a distraction or not good for you no more so let's get into it y'all we got a um we got a person well we got a person and then we got a song so we got Megan the Stallion so okay yeah y'all kind of like freaky a little bit like y'all might not be afraid to like you know let that side of yourselves out i'm i'm seeing wop okay <laughs> the video and it's just like y'all aren't afraid to like say what's on your mind like i said with this um where the fucking crystal go damn yeah where it go here go <laughs> y'all um y'all know making this stallion be like you know kind of like treating niggas to her music she be like um you know <laughs> she um like she she do what she do she get what she want then she gonna leave she gonna dip on you especially like if you not you know living up to her standards and her expectations it's like she don't get no fucks like i said like y'all the types like maybe hook up with somebody and like tell they ass to leave when it's over or like get your shit and leave when it's done for the song we got did it on him Nicki Minaj so yeah I feel like y'all got a lot of haters too okay a lot of haters I feel like a couple of your haters could be people who have dealt with the people that you dealt with romantically in the past okay um this could even be like you know say you had a boyfriend like so all their exes would be jealous of you because you got all this sex appeal and they all they um exes will be jealous because this person is treating you like they never got treated because like they went for everything it's like you know you a standard like you you have standards you have like the ability to upgrade people just by teaching them how to treat you okay so it's like you don't let nobody tell you any type of thing you don't let anything like go it's just like you saying this is what it is if you ain't with it you gotta go okay nobody gonna take your happiness because you are happy within yourself okay it's like you know you the bomb you know you did it on them like you don't even have nothing to worry about so we gonna get into the cards so what makes y'all a savage we get in libra okay so i feel like y'all are very balanced okay y'all could definitely be very beautiful y'all could be into the arts okay i'm getting like i'm hearing feng shui so a couple of you guys could like have a nicely decorated house or apartment okay and like the fact that you just like built a sanctuary like for yourself and just like decorated things to your liking like that just brings you so much more inner, inner peace than you realize okay because like when you were living in a space that you love that you adore that you took your time in it's like a sense of accomplishment and it's like you know your love for beauty your love for art your love for you know being balanced and you know being in your own element is a, like savage like and i'm also hearing some of you guys like janae echo and like people be trying to say janae echo like i feel like janae echo a city girl okay she just like sing what the city girls like rap <laughs> so it's like yeah you got this zen energy about you but at the same time it's like you just say things you say the same thing that people other people say that people could take offensively but you just kind of say it in a softer nicer way okay we got engineer so ability to give creative energy a practical expression talent for designing resolutions to common dilemmas so yeah like y'all are very balanced i feel like something else that makes you a savage is y'all aren't afraid to see something from a different perspective y'all not afraid to see things from both sides of an argument okay and like i feel like 
it's like y'all are very good problem solvers as well i am feeling like like y'all could be called a lot by y'all friends or y'all family like when they have a problem it's like i know who to call i'm gonna call this person because this person probably know what to do this person could engineer me up a solution so like with this too being about focus this crystal for me i feel like y'all mind makes you a savage the fact that y'all know so much so like i say some a lot of y'all could be gemini's and you just like just know a lot of random information i'm feeling like but it's like you know people enjoy your mind okay people even enjoy when you speak i'm hearing we have pioneers so passive for doing and creating things that have not done that have not been done before so it's like people just love the fact that you are willing to create and you are willing to uh, i'm hearing step outside the box this could be my pile of trendsetters okay like y'all are always the person to do things first okay y'all aren't afraid to you know start things off y'all aren't afraid to um you know be at the head of something y'all could even be my pal of leaders your um drive to lead and create new things and to go on your own path also makes you a savage okay because you know if people are following in your lead there is no way they could ever be ahead of you because you got to make the first move for them to make right so it's like yeah y'all just you know don't mind stepping up a couple of you guys i'm hearing could be teachers of some type as well and like i just said that all the information that you know makes you a savage okay your mind look boom intuition so a couple of you guys could even be um tarot readers i'm hearing y'all could just have a bomb intuition y'all could be empaths my psychics my witches okay and it's like y'all just know things and like i feel like people are just like so enamored by you because it's like dang like how she know all that like dang okay i'm turned on this girl knows stuff that i don't know like people think you a savage because they always feel like they learn something when they come around you i'm feeling like and then we have shadow so i feel like y'all also have the ability to discern what people are for you and what people are not for you okay and i also feel like you guys have done a lot of inner work especially inner child work on yourselves and confronting y'all shadow to get to where you are today you guys could have even made a lot of mistakes in the past which is why you are so good at solving problems it's because you've been in a lot of problems or a lot of situations that you know you needed to get yourself out of so it's just like y'all just i'm feeling like y'all are focused y'all are level-headed like y'all are clear on what y'all want we got thinker so yep y'all could spend a lot of time in your head too we got thinker and intuition like like i'm telling y'all it's y'all mind that makes y'all a savage it's your ideas it's y'all thoughts it's y'all um like the way you go about things it's your balance it's the way you treat like um your family and those close to you y'all could even um <laughs> if somebody mess with the people y'all love like y'all wouldn't hesitate to probably cuss their ass out or something it's just like your power and your savagery is in your mind okay we have a imagine yeah like imagine think you're in like um intuition like i'm hearing um lemonade so y'all turn lemons into lemonade okay it's just like y'all could somebody could give y'all something okay and you could just imagine something totally different when it comes into your hand and you could just create something from that one thing people be like dang all you had was that all you got was that you create all that you like yeah because i got a strong intuition i know what to do my imagination popping my intuition popping okay i got discernment you know i know what to put my energy into and what not to put my energy into okay and of course i'm smart as hell so what you got to say it's like I, i'm getting the queen of swords energy too so a lot of y'all could probably cut people with y'all words when y'all want to we got patience here so it's like okay you think about all this stuff you got all this creations you putting your energy into all these things that you want to bring into fruition but you also have the patience to wait for it okay you know some people plant the seed and they get mad when it don't um sprout in a day or two and it's just like you understand that you have to wait for things it's like you have patience i'm feeling like a person that like you know you creep up slowly right and then when it's time to leap you leap okay this is my pile of people that move in silence y'all surprise a lot of people with y'all moves because it's like people not expecting what y'all doing it's like y'all oh oh y'all it's a wasp oh jesus don't come over here <laughs> uh people that's that's a good thing um people feel like <laughs> with that wasp 
like y'all like like i said y'all words could sting but it's like also like y'all do things that un that are unexpected okay it's like i feel like like i said a lot of y'all could have haters and like people be trying to bring you down and get you down but it's like you know you'll retreat you'll come in you'll think about something you'll make a plan and then you pop out with this next thing and it's like stinging y'all haters because like they be like dang how does she do this like how does she do this so it's like i feel like if people fucked with you in the past they are quickly learning that they cannot ever fuck with you again in the future okay yep we got door to value y'all my money makers okay um yeah a lot of y'all could have even been like the smart kids in the past like y'all could have been ain't nothing wrong with being a nerd okay i was a nerd y'all i was in band all that but <laughs> it's like y'all could have been that way in the past but it's like y'all have glue, glue up and it's like you still get that smartness okay you still get all those lessons that you learn from like childhood and everything on so it's like nah shit you look good and you got the mind to match so it's like you starting to see how everything works out in your favor even if you feel like it's a bad situation okay but it's like y'all intuition is on point so whatever money making ideas y'all been having it's time to go after it because that is the exact thing that you need to do we got fear okay so it's like i feel like y'all just have confronted y'all fears on like so many levels with this being right under shadow it's like y'all have come to terms with your fears you have come to terms with things that have happened to you in the past mistakes that you have made things that you had to forgive other people about and even yourself about and it's like i feel like fear can like no longer touch you it's like this is you like in this um bubble like in this golden bubble it's like you were once in this place but now you have just come up you have sprouted and it's like i said y'all are taking advantage of even the bad situations that have happened to you the darkness that you have been in okay and people think that is incredibly savage incredibly sexy don't not everybody will sit up there and dive deep within themselves to confront themselves to confront their demons and to attempt to heal okay like not a lot of people do that so the fact that y'all do it the fact that y'all are healing and the fact that y'all are getting things together true it's making y'all haters man but it's just also turning you into even more of, of a savage okay we get mastery yeah okay so a couple of you guys have been like on a path to creating something okay or you've been thinking about something i'm hearing two years um two years in the making you have been like thinking about this path that you want to take or something you want to start this is your sign to start it okay um you could be seeing 444 a lot but i'm just taking this as you guys are very protected okay and soon you will reach the next level or the next step within something that you have been trying to manifest and bring into your life okay we have nurturer yeah y'all been nurturing something y'all been um this could even be yourselves like y'all have been nursing yourselves and y'all mental health and like all of your weaknesses y'all have been like tending to yourselves and y'all mind and that is why you're about to reach this next level of self i feel like y'all are mastering like a level of y'all lives and y'all about to graduate y'all are about to be upgraded okay we got the hermit so yeah y'all definitely went within to get some type of spiritual enlightenment and i feel like like i said going back to like y'all space like y'all home like or even like your room it's like you know you enjoy being in your sanctuary i'm hearing you enjoy being put up and the fact that you aren't always easy to access is a um makes you a savage okay you don't necessarily need people to live and survive we got king of wine so y'all are also a very passionate energy whatever this is y'all that y'all been um nurturing and y'all been trying to go after whatever project whatever um this path is it's time to go for it okay full force we got seven of pentacles yeah y'all be chilling Excuse me, y'all be chilling, y'all pop out when y'all want to, y'all talk when y'all want to, y'all flirt when y'all want to, okay? I'm surely getting a feeling that a lot of y'all are single and y'all just mingling like y'all um y'all not like necessarily looking for a relationship because y'all are looking for y'all selves. We got a name of chalices. So it's like, yeah, I feel like y'all y'all could i mean a couple of you guys would be in a relationship but i feel like y'all not really interested in love right now because you're more so interested in yourself or this could even be somebody these could even be people that want to talk to you but they just feel like you they can't access access you or they feel like they won't measure up to you so it's like they can't ever figure out what to say to you so a couple of you guys could have a lot of secret admirers i am hearing we have one and off so i'm hearing non-stop by drake so a couple of you guys are also very 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 hard workers okay y'all know when to switch work mode on and went to switch it off 
we got boss here so yeah a couple of you guys could be self-employed own your own business have your own thing going on and that makes you a savage okay we have a teardrop or a water so y'all could be water slabs but i'm feeling like y'all have just been through so much like i'm even feeling like internal conflict or mental conflict that y'all have just healed and moved past okay it's like can nothing hurt you like can nobody say anything about you that will make you feel a type of way because you acknowledge like your mistakes and where you have went wrong you acknowledge your downfalls and you have come to terms with it it's like can't nobody use your past against you that makes you a savage I mean, then we have weight in reverse so yeah whatever project y'all y'all been working on wanting to start off now is the time okay it's the time to get out there it's the time to make this dream come true and then the fact that y'all are action oriented makes you a savage as well so yeah that's what i am getting for you pal number two if you enjoyed this reading don't forget to like share comment and subscribe and i will see you guys later Hey pal number three, if you chose this green adventuring, welcome to your reading. So y'all, I associate this crystal with good luck and success. So people just feel like you are a good luck magnet. They feel like you attract a lot of success and abundance, okay? I'm hearing people could even be jealous of this good luck and success that you have, okay? A couple of you guys could even have, I'm hearing Jupiter and Sagittarius. But we gonna get right into the cards. We gonna first start off with a sign not a sign y'all <laughs> with a person and a song okay so for, the, for your person you got beyonce okay so i'm hearing on that line um um from savage so like y'all y'all some of y'all names could be tina but if y'all mama named tina this is confirmation you definitely a savage <laughs> but it's like with beyonce here you know beyonce is a very private person she like gives y'all a little bit then she pulls back she gives you a little bit then she pulls back okay and she also runs on her own time okay and she's not afraid to you know start off things new she's not afraid to start a trend i am feeling like but she's also not looking to start a trend she's looking to um, create a legacy so i feel like y'all unintentionally start trends just by being y'all selves and that's what makes you a savage your energy is just one that people admire and want to follow because you attract all this luck and success okay so we got don't hurt yourself by beyonce oh my god so <laughs> this is perfect y'all um so lemonade could y'all could like the album lemonade okay but it's like if y'all not in a relationship, the next relationship y'all gonna be in, like, I feel like <laughs> that man gonna be scared of y'all, or a woman, in a good way, in, 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 in a good relationship way, like, they'll be afraid to, like, fuck with you, I'm hearing, y'all know how she be screaming, who the fuck do you think I am, that's the type of energy you got, it's like, people, like, just know, like, please, please don't fuck with her, please, it's like, I'm hearing irreplaceable, but it's like, people know that you are replaceable. People like know that you're it. So it's like, and it's a yellow butterfly flying past. And we talking about lemonade. Literally like, all y'all exes or anybody that has done you dirty romantically, like they having some regrets, especially if they not in your life no more. But it's like, I'm feeling like y'all be giving people wake up calls too. Like you, you really, like you really gonna do this? Like you really, you really trying to be here and fuck with me like this? All right, I got something for your ass. And then you go back, you blow up, and you come back and they get mad. So like you just a savage, cause shit, you you build in private, you create your legacy, you build what you wanna do, and you not worried about people accepting it because it's your art. But people do accept it. Like no matter what you create or no matter what you wanna start off, it's just like you know. Y'all just had this energy. Like, I feel like y'all got, like, um, like the golden touch, okay? Like, everything you touch turns to magic, I'm even hearing. So, we got in Aquarius, y'all. Yeah, in Aquarius, your vision. And y'all know Aquarius is the sign of innovation. It is the sign of change. So, it's like, y'all not afraid to change things. Y'all not afraid to step up and be like, okay, this ain't working. I'm hearing this, this ain't working. I don't know if y'all ever seen... Um, a clip of Beyonce and like I guess she was working with some people um what she said she was like um <laughs> they don't know what they doing I cannot trust them or when she <laughs> or when she was like um you can't put blue light on black girls like that don't work so it's like y'all not afraid to come in and like a search out energy and be like this is what the fuck it is this is what the fuck it ain't and people admire that about you people admire that you are willing to take charge and create your own you know your own legacy your own thing your own um passions I'm feeling like 
we got child divine innocent purity and redemption suggests a special connection with the divine so yeah a lot of y'all are very heavily spiritually protected okay y'all carry this pure childlike energy the reason why y'all are so creative is because y'all could have done a lot of inner child healing i'm hearing so it's like you don't have that many creative blocks okay you're allowing yourself to flourish and like even you could even want to go back and watch the last pal um you're just allowing yourself to flourish and you're allowing yourself to take advantage of things that could have happened to you in the past by turning them around and like being an alchemist but i just feel like change it's like y'all believe in change y'all don't think that things should stay the same okay like y'all don't mind you know taking a risk and trying to do something different in the in for the sake of your passion for the sake of like your creativity i'm hearing a lot of you guys could even be seeing cardinals it's a cardinal up here okay and um, that is definitely a sign that your angels are around and watching you. We have priests, so facilitate spiritual commitment, serve as a channel of spiritual energy. So y'all could be um, witches, y'all could be tarot readers, y'all could be psychics, okay? Um, but it's like y'all aren't afraid to have a spiritual connection with the divine, okay? Y'all, you guys probably pray a lot, and that is why you so you're such a savage as well, and why you attract so much good luck and success is because you pray about things, you set intentions on things. Like y'all manifestation game is one a hundred, okay? It's like y'all are not afraid. Like this kind of romantic me of the sun it's like y'all not afraid to look up to the sun and let all the old stuff all the shadows like fall behind you okay y'all know that quote um if you point your head to the sun all the shadows find, um, shine behind you so it's like y'all don't care about leaving behind the old to get to the new i'm feeling like we got awareness so i feel like y'all know it's like y'all get intuitive nudges about stuff but like y'all know things before everybody else knows it okay or like y'all intuitively know like what's gonna be the next big thing in a couple of years so y'all know how to you know navigate and how to move to get um to take advantage of any situation or opportunity that arises okay i just feel like y'all are just very intuitive okay what makes you a savage is that you just be knowing you just be intuitively knowing what to do you be intuitively knowing how to move forward okay we got mental conflict so i do feel like y'all could um y'all could possibly um go back and forth a lot <laughs> sometimes okay like y'all could um want to create so many things and have so many passions at times that y'all just feel like dang which one do i choose which way do i go but this is saying like you don't necessarily have to make a choice okay make a list of all the things that you want to do and then just choose like two or three of them to focus on at a time okay um one thing i do feel like y'all could potentially um spread yourself thin sometimes or y'all could have in the past just because y'all want to do so much y'all want to create so much y'all want to get so far but this is just a message like it's okay to focus on one or two things at a time and that's not saying that you can't make the other things happen but it's like you know if you allow yourself to focus on one thing get that done the next thing get that done you know what i'm saying so it's like y'all just got so much so many good ideas so much that you could bring to the world it kind of get confusing to you sometimes but like I just feel like y'all got it like all y'all all, all gotta do is think or, or whatever and connect to the divine and they gonna tell you which way to move or which steps to go or to take so we got time for a nap here right under in aquarius so y'all could um with this time for a nap here I feel like what makes you a savage is people think that they could play you, okay? People think that they could do things behind your, your back sometimes, or they used to, okay? And people just think that you're not going to notice. But I feel like you know the sneaky shit that be going on around you. Like, you, your intuition be popping so you know when somebody, you know, is full of shit or not. And it's like, you a savage because you don't confront them about it. Like, you don't, you know... You just take note i'm hearing you just take note and when it is time to say something or when it's time to you know bring something to the light you're not afraid to say oh remember blah 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 that remember when you did that remember when you did that not like that but it's like a um people could build up so much trying to play you and then like you just play it cool and when it just goes over the edge you like um sir or ma'am and then you get them together real quick it's not like a necessary like remember like when you did this but it's like a people could be trying to play you and get so far but it's just like you just watch them sit there and make a fool of themselves because you know one day all this gonna come out and they gonna feel stupid because you knew the whole time what was going on a lot of y'all could have even had a lot of um 
flaky or um, sneaky friends around y'all that y'all cut off as well. We got a yup. We got a change in the wind. Yeah, y'all could have um, y'all could have cut off a lot of friends that y'all met in childhood. Y'all could not associate with that many people from school. Um, the schools that you went to, I am hearing. Um, this just blew over, so don't hurt yourself. So, like, a lot of people, I'm hearing bullying. A lot of people could have even tried to bully you in the past, okay? But it's like, they finna hurt themselves because they ain't know that you was a star and they ain't know that you about to shine as bright as you about to shine, okay? So, it's a lot of change going on in the wind. So, like, if that resonates for you, like, if you were picked on a lot or if you were, like, bullied at any point in time, okay? If you were ever put in this energy, okay? This energy has transformed into this energy of being aware and being intuitive. And there is a change in the wind okay and all the motherfuckers that will sleep on you they about to wake up okay because you a savage and that's that on that it's like you just different i'm here i'm here i'm different yeah i'm different <laughs> and it's like that th your differences are about to be the reason why you shine and glow up so much yeah, we have the world. Y'all have definitely completed a cycle, okay? Um, a couple of you guys could have just getting in, just gotten into manifestation and spirituality. And y'all uh, are realizing that y'all are capable of giving y'all own self the world through manifestation and different techniques, okay? So it's like, um, don't hold back. I'm here, um best thing i never had by beyonce so that could be a message or a confirmation for somebody but it's like somebody that did you wrong in the past the cycle is coming full circle coming to an end so if somebody did you dirty whether it be a friend or a lover somebody from the past know that that they are either getting their karma right now or they are about to receive their karma we have appreciation so yeah i feel like y'all just been through so much that y'all are just this grateful energy now it's like y'all appreciate everything that y'all have in y'all lives what makes you a savage is that you have so much gratitude which is why you attract this good luck and success and like the universe sees how grateful that you are so that is why you attract so many wonderful new things okay and then we got growth so yeah a lot of people put y'all in a bad predicament in the past or like you a lot of people just couldn't make y'all feel like shit or try to like ruin you i'm hearing oh my god yeah a lot of people could have just tried to come at you or try to just get you to dim your light or try to hold you back or keep you from your destiny and your success but it's like all the dirt that they threw at you it's like you planted seeds and grew flowers from it okay and it's like they will sleep but it's change coming they about to wake their ass up okay the universe is about to be like hello you fucked with this person here your karma <laughs> and a lot of you guys these people's karma is um your change these people karma is that they're no longer in your life and their karma is that they have to watch you glow up without them okay so this could i'm hearing this could even be an old best friend or something somebody that was close to you or people that were close to you tried to bring you down but it's like you like i said you grew flowers from the dirt that they threw on your name or threw at you we got beauty in reverse so <laughs> I'm taking this a few different ways. So the first thing, people could have tried to come at your looks in the past, but that's over. Or you could have not had the most confidence in yourself as a child, but that is over. Like, you're about to start acknowledging your beauty. But I'm also hearing, it's like, when people do you dirty, when people sleep on you, it's like, I'm hearing, I'm hearing mask off by future, but like, in a good way. It's like, you know, your beauty could turn ugly real quick if somebody fuck with you. Like, that's the savage. It's like... <laughs> what's that movie y'all what is that movie um dang oh y'all um incredibles y'all know how the son had that superpower where it was like he was a baby he was all innocent but as soon as you fucked with him he turned into a monster and was like Bleh. <laughs> so that y'all got some of that going on too it's like you know when things get ugly like you're not afraid to defend yourself and stand up for yourself boom we got radical acceptance so yeah y'all are definitely accepting of the past i feel like because y'all been through so much y'all are accepting of other people especially um people that have made mistakes y'all could really root for the underdog i am hearing as well and we got humor so it's like this situation that happened in the past or like these bad things that could have happened to you when you were younger as a child it's like you found the humor in the situation it's like you you know you're not really worried about it no more like you found ways to laugh or you found ways to think about it in the best way possible which is why you are, have been allowed to grow and have appreciation for those chapters in your life so much because you understand that it was all just a lesson and a test to upgrade you for this next part of your life 
we got seven of swords yeah a lot of people feel left out by you horses could be important to somebody or tulips i'm hearing or red roses a lot of people feel out in the cold or left out by you but i feel like they did it to themselves and you sit up there watching this like yep <laughs> you didn't play yourself you played yourself <laughs> we got four of chalices yeah because you left you went away you could have with these scissors here like you could have um and it, this looked like the bird i just saw it's like you could have um cut a lot of people off and now they looking back and like they salty bitches we got <laughs> we got eight of wands here so y'all are very action oriented now y'all um y'all go after what y'all want like i said like beyonce um don't argue with these lazy bitches i just raised my price so y'all been raising y'all price the price is going up period we got queen of wands yeah y'all definitely have this passion now this burning passion this fire within you and a couple of you guys could have a weird thing for earrings y'all could really like earrings or collect earrings or have a lot of earrings or jewelry um but uh i feel like people just try to chain y'all down and it's like you collected your shit and you left and you walked away and now you making all these changes so what makes you a savage is you have changed like times 100 to the max and you have grown flowers from the dirt we have um the stoplight red light green light yellow light so with that i'm just taking it as you could have been on pause okay but <laughs> y'all know what i'm thinking about um that flavor of love reunion when new york was like my ass has been on pause, okay? But I'm about to press play in a motherfucking millisecond. <laughs> so I feel like y'all could have been on pause or like y'all could have held back. But y'all about to press play or y'all have just recently press play. And like people just about to see like, um, I'm hearing um, Black Parade. So just like your drip. Y'all walking into a, a phase where y'all about to have new drip, okay? Like y'all could be going out more y'all could be like taking risks taking shots you know just going after things like hey you know it's worth the shot it's worth the try okay and we get all me came up that's all me for real drake so like what makes you a savage is y'all not afraid to do it by yourselves y'all not afraid to be different y'all not afraid to take shots y'all not afraid to connect to your intuition and the divine y'all not afraid to be grateful okay and it just makes you a savage that can't nothing hold you back can't nothing hold you down i'm hearing um um, can't hold us down by christina aguilera and i'm hearing loving me for me by christina aguilera too so can't nobody hold you back or put you know nothing against you or hold you down because you know you for yourself okay like you know i feel like y'all been through a lot of things alone and so y'all don't feel like y'all need people because y'all got the divine y'all got your intuition and a lot of you guys are coming into contact with your soul family very soon okay but with this beyonce here and don't hurt yourself you know make sure you could trust people before you disclose any information to them okay <laughs> make their ass sound a uh, uh, nda <laughs> but yeah y'all that's why i'm getting for pal number three so if you like this reading don't forget to like share comment and subscribe and i will see y'all in the next video Hey, pal number four, if you chose this crystal, welcome to your reading. So, y'all know, um, what was that movie? Um, there was a Disney movie with Ali and AJ, y'all. Um, what's that song they did? I don't know, the song, and it was like, Do You Believe in Magic? Dun, 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 dun. Y'all know that song? If you know, you know. <laughs> but it's like, um, y'all are magical. People feel like you are magical. It's something different about you. It's something unique, okay? It's something that just shines. Like, this is one of my most different crystals, I feel like. And it just, like, reflects so many colors. So, like, y'all just have so many different sides of y'all. I'm feeling like y'all just, like... Y'all just reflect so many things. I'm feeling like y'all could be inspirational as well. But, like, that just makes you a savage. Like, you multifaceted. So, I could have some Geminis in the building. Shout out, Geminis. Hey, Gemini. I'm a Gemini, too. <laughs> so, we're going to get into it. We got a song and we got a person. So, how are you a savage, okay? So, we got your, not your main city girls, y'all. This has been my cut for the past week, okay? You up here telling them I'm not your main thing, okay? It's like, you know... You that bitch, but you not they bitch. Okay, period. And then we got Nicki Minaj. So, yeah. 
this just screams like I'm in my power I'm in control of myself okay um, I embrace my sexuality can't no nigga play me okay I'm that girl that's just that on that period okay like I said I'm that bitch but I am not your bitch <laughs> it's like with this Nicki Minaj energy it's like I'm here um y'all um, remember go hard by Nicki Minaj it's like you know y'all go hard for what y'all want and it's like shit people wish they could get rid of you but they can't oh my god my toe in it my toe in it y'all don't make fun of me i ain't i gotta go get them done but <laughs> it's like um you just know your worth i'm hearing i'm hearing know your worth uh what's that his name is khalid 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 it's like y'all know y'all worth and y'all not afraid to express yourselves and to let people know y'all worth if they act like they forgot okay so we gonna get right into it so we got in the eighth oh my god what i say in the eighth house okay personal power a major change okay so y'all look this is scorpio energy so like i said y'all not afraid to be sexual y'all not afraid to step into y'all power and let somebody know what it is and what it ain't okay y'all not y'all are not afraid to transform that's what it is too that's why um where the hell did the crystal go <laughs> that's why it's like y'all got so many different sides or so many different colors and so many different y'all just so multifaceted because y'all have been through so many changes and transformation i'm hearing um metamorphosis and somebody like somebody out there y'all could have liked Hil hillary duff or y'all could have liked lizzie mcguire and like this is this extra confirmation that this message is for you but it's like y'all are just just multifaceted i'm feeling like y'all just have been through so many changes and transformation that just that just makes you a savage y'all could even be interested in a lot of things or like i'm feeling like a lot of you guys could have lived a lot of lives in a way it's like a couple of you guys could have moved cities a couple of different times and it's just like your transitions make you a savage the fact that people don't know what they're gonna get when it comes to you okay your change your transformation we got we got liberated here freeing yourselves and others from outmoded beliefs releasing negative thought patterns y'all are just so free-spirited it makes you a savage that y'all are not afraid to step away from things that no longer serve you if something is um keeping you from being in your power keeping you from changing and transitioning and being in yourself y'all not afraid to be like listen you gotta go i need to liberate myself from this i need to change i feel like what makes you a savage is y'all like change and y'all see consistent transformation y'all see consistent growth we have rebel yeah y'all don't give a fuck <laughs> it's like challenges authority to affect social change reject spiritual systems that do not serve inner needs like y'all don't care <laughs> y'all are like if something is getting in my way if something is in the way of my personal power if something is in the way of this next phase of this next chapter in my life or if this is someone like y'all are not afraid to rebel okay it's like if it's not fitting what you want if it's not fitting in what you thought you know you should be pursuing you're not afraid to say all right you know i can't do this okay y'all probably help a lot of people step into their power as well okay because they see you being a rebel they see you liberating yourself yourself from things that um no longer serves you or you know that aren't for you and they're like okay i could do it too so what makes you a savage is y'all encourage people to um step away from things that are no longer good for them by you doing it okay so a lot of people could follow in your footsteps and a lot of people want to embody the the energy that you body because it's just like y'all can't be fucked with okay y'all can't we got spiritual union here hold on so spiritual union i feel like a lot of y'all are in spiritual union with y'all selves but a couple of you guys if you are already not in a higher level soulmate commitment y'all are going to be in a spiritual union with somebody that matches you okay so what makes you a savage is that you are about to be in a power couple dynamic with somebody else that is also a savage okay um i'm feeling aquarius energy like i said we got scorpio energy i just heard libra um gemini um yeah also hearing capricorn leo but either way y'all what makes y'all a savage or what's gonna even make y'all more of a savage is y'all about to be in a power couple dynamic with somebody um else that is also in their power yeah we got partnerships and alliances so if y'all been waiting to come into spiritual union with somebody or you um you're in spiritual union with somebody y'all are about to i'm hearing change love why i just hear that change love change how people see love 
relationships. That's why I probably heard Libra. Yet, yeah, some for a couple of y'all, this ain't everybody for this pal. This is a sad note. I don't even know why this came out like this because this is about um, being a savage. But a couple of y'all, y'all destiny and being this savage involves you being a savage with somebody else. Oh my God, what the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? Oh, hell no. I'm about to take my ass and say, what the fuck? I ain't never seen a bug like that before. Like, y'all, y'all, I have never seen a bug like the bug I just saw. And I was afraid as shit. So, y'all, like, y'all are about to, a couple of y'all, about to enter into a relationship. <laughs> and it's, like, going to change how people see things. It's going to change how people see love, okay? And it's, like, that bug was kind of scary to me. So, like, y'all are definitely going to be a power couple. And people, like, are just going to be, like, I don't know why I'm hearing starstruck. People are gonna be starstruck by y'all energy or y'all energy together. This is weird. Hold on. We gotta clean it up. So, like I said, y'all could have been through a lot of struggles in the past. So, y'all could have, like, I'm getting the energy of somebody that could, like, I don't want to say you messed your life up in the past, but it was just like something that like, it was something major that happened that just kind of like shook your whole world up. I don't know why I just heard eighth grade. That's for somebody. But it's like you have cleaned up like so much of your life. And the fact that you have went through that and came out successful has showed you that you can have anything you want, okay? You are a rebel. You can do whatever it is that you want. So that bad situation, bad actually turn to work out for your highest good because it taught you how to start from the ground and work your way up okay and i feel like a lot of y'all are about to come into union with somebody who has done the same thing we have treasure island yeah you cleaned up your act you cleaned up yourself i'm hearing habits mindsets belief all of that and now you are about to be rewarded with your treasure island so if you have been manifesting a relationship you are about to come into contact with somebody that is your equal okay and y'all shit y'all oh my god like the love i just felt y'all are about to like y'all about to i'm just feeling like somebody here is going to change love or change how people view love or like power couple ish like um, y'all know Beyonce and Jay-Z, like, real power couple. Like, y'all just about to, y'all about to shake some up, I'm feeling like. We got happy family here, yup. And then look, the car of four. I just mentioned Beyonce and Jay-Z. So, a couple of you guys, um, could, like, even be, um, uh, potentially be, like, in the, um, the spotlight. Y'all could be, um, have a platform or y'all could, um, I don't know why I'm hearing Hollywood stars. Like a couple of you guys could actually potentially end up being famous one day. Um, that's for a select few, y'all. Don't be taking everything and running and going with it if y'all if y'all know that ain't the message for you. But I'm just saying, like, it's a couple people here. This could even just be be for two or three people that's watching this. Like, y'all could potentially end up, you know, being in the spotlight or like being um, being well known for something one day if you aren't already. But it's like, what's well, gonna make you a savage? Like, you a savage already, yeah. But what's going to make you a savage is partnering up with this person. Hmm. We got Blossom in Abundance right under Spiritual Union. So, yeah. Um, what's going to make you even more of a savage is your other half. The person that was made for you. Your equal. This is really interesting, y'all. Y'all know I don't see these cards before I do the reading. Um... I would have redid this deck honestly because this is supposed to be about y'all but shit this is the message spirit I wanted you to hear it's like um I'm hearing make me better by um fabulous and neo as well we got hunger it's in reverse though hunger in reverse under partnerships and alliances so a couple of y'all um are about to um y'all are a savage because y'all aren't needy okay with this hunger like y'all aren't needy like y'all y'all attract y'all don't chase y'all let things come to y'all okay y'all have like been through so many like changes and everything it's like you figured out that you like really only need yourself you really only need to accept yourself not not everybody needs to understand you your plan and what you're doing it's like in the past where you could have valid felt valid about other people's opinions or assault other people's opinions on your action it's like now oh my god it's a dragonfly flying around yeah now you have transformed and like you really don't need validation from anybody it's like you just like you just want to be <laughs> so it's like i feel like this connection 
could could teach you even more of this or this connection has taught you this if you are in this connection already i just feel like y'all aren't in this energy of chasing no more y'all just attraction attracting which makes you a savage we got truth so it could have been something in the past i am hearing that you had to acknowledge the truth about i don't know why i'm here in college for somebody so like this could have been something that happened to you in college um you acknowledge the truth or um a truth was spoken to you or um yeah or somebody could have tried to um hide the truth or somebody could have tried to um, say something was true about you and it really wasn't uh, they were just hating hating ass motherfuckers anyway <laughs> it's like with this truth card here like you could have just acknowledged the truth and cleaned it up and step into your power so like i said something that happened to you in the past is actually about to work in your favor okay i'm hearing be real too just be real and just tell the truth okay i'm hearing see things for what they are you see things for how they are which is why you're allowed to be liberated from them because y'all know we cannot change what um we don't accept so like y'all are very accepting and that is why you're allowed to move forward and get this abundance that you're about to get and i hear a plane y'all Y'all know planes remind me of Lift Off by Jay-Z and Beyonce. And we had the number four here. And we got Spiritual Union. And if y'all did not know, Jay-Z and Beyonce are twin flames. So we have Assurance here. So yeah, I feel like um, if this is resonating for you, this relationship part, like, I'm hearing it. Uh, <sighs> Get off my car, bud. What the hell? um i'm hearing match made in heaven it's like rest assured like this person is gonna be for you like you've been praying for a union or something this is completely off topic spirit like seriously i'm trying to talk about savages i don't know what the hell spirit doing um but it's like i'm not trying to say guaranteed but it's like y'all are gonna be secure in this connection and like what it does to y'all what it brings to y'all we got Queen of Swords, so Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy, okay? So, it's like, y'all could be real smart. Y'all could be real intellectual. This could be this person that y'all are about to match up with if you haven't already. And like I said, like, this person is going to be so smart. Like, this person is going to add value to you and make you a savage. Like, that's how smart this person is. Like, they um have a lot of um, information I'm hearing. I'm hearing information. So what also makes you a savage, <laughs> y'all, um, y'all, this pal is kind of tripping me up because I didn't ask for this type of message. <laughs> so it's kind of like weird. Um, it's like with this 10 of wands here, I feel like y'all can handle a lot at once. Okay. Y'all are, um, my multitaskers. Like I said, where the crystal go? Y'all are like multifaceted. Y'all can do a lot of things or y'all have a lot of different types of goals. Y'all have a lot of interests, okay? And you're a savage because it is, um, I don't want to say it's easy for you, but you definitely make it look easy to get, get everything in as you get done. We have two of swords here. So yeah, with this two of swords here and then this hunger being in reverse, I'm feeling like y'all attract a lot of suitors, especially if you're a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Y'all attract a lot of suitors because y'all aren't needy, okay? Y'all have probably like worked through a lot of codependency issues, which also makes you a savage. It's because like, I'm here and I could do bad all by myself. So it's like, you could do it alone. It's like, you don't got to be nobody's main thing. You'll rather be single than to be, be you know, um trying to be hungry for somebody or be thirsty for somebody and you know with Nicki Minaj here it's like shit Nicki Minaj literally like did her career like she got all, all that together and then she came out and now she having a baby so it's like you put yourself first which makes you a savage so even in this spiritual union yes like y'all gonna be for each other but it's gonna make you a savage that you also have your own life and your own identity outside of this relationship that's what it is we got five of pentacles so um, this relationship gonna be real romantic. So your romance could make you a savage, okay? Um, we got Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Aries, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Energy. I'm also hearing water signs, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio with all this water. But it's like, I'm feeling like, um, yeah, this gonna be a really romantic connection. 
wow this is weird y'all we got fire signs every single Sagittarius so real fiery real steamy real passionate or this could even be y'all okay being real creative we have heartbreak hold on y'all this is pissing me off <laughs> Because what are they talking about? Maybe this is like you bounce back from heartbreak very soon. Or you could have had your heart broken by a fire sign in the past and you bounce back from that, okay? Um, yeah, it's like you don't let things keep you down for long, I'm hearing. And your relationships have actually taught you a lot. Like a lot, a lot, a lot. So don't ever regret a relationship. Because, you know, if it didn't give you what you wanted, it taught you something that you needed to learn, right? So we got wishing, but it's on in reverse. So maybe y'all wishes are on hold for something. It's like y'all been wishing for something, but it's a little bit more work to do first before y'all um, get this wish. But your wishes are gonna come true. It's just a lot of things that might need to happen in behind the scenes or in the background first. And I feel like what makes you a savage is like y'all like don't care how long it takes. Like y'all gonna fight for what y'all want. Like y'all gonna continue to wish upon the same damn star until that star give you your wish. So like y'all know the, the universe falls in love with the stubborn heart. So whatever you continue to manifest, as long as you're manifesting until you get it, you're gonna get it, right? And so then we have a lightning bolt. So like I feel like um, something is about to catch y'all by surprise, okay? Or y'all catch people by surprise. Like, y'all energy, like y'all lightning, like what y'all bring to the table. Like, y'all could probably just enter into a room and just light up the whole room and just have people looking at y'all, okay? Um, I'm just feeling like, um, it just makes y'all presence in general is striking, okay? And that makes y'all a savage. Y'all, this part was a little different. But um, I hope that it all resonated. If you like this video, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I will see y'all in the next video.